Namaste. Hello, my dear beautiful Capricorn. How are you all doing today? I welcome you all to your channel. This is your host Shivansh. Those who are new to my channel, thank you so very much for tuning in. I really, really appreciate that. All right. So we are doing this reading during the new moon. All right. And this, uh, whenever you see this reading, that's the right time to get these messages. So uh, all that universe is asking you right now capricorn that stay grounded and stay focused because there's a lot taking place in your uh, subconscious mind yeah and there's a lot taking place in your subconscious mind god is actually cleaning your subconscious mind all right that means everything is taking place in the spirit world for you right now all right so you may feel really really emotional at times you feel triggered by anything that you see anything you feel i mean whatever is coming to you as a feeling as a vision as something that is like kind of taking you by surprise emotionally all right yeah taking you by surprise emotionally and this uh, uh, full this new moon to full moon the energy uh, will be very very intense emotionally all right so if you have a strong placement of capricorn moon sign capricorn ascendant capricorn sun or you have strong placements of uh, any uh, strong jupiter uh, and, and i said jupiter some of you may have jupiter in your cap in the house of capricorn all right so if you have some strong planetary um uh, stationaries uh, planet stationaries in the house of capricorn then there is something major taking place in your life so you can go ahead and take a look of your natal chart you will be able to get to see what exactly i'm trying to say all right so let's see capricorn what you can expect coming your way capricorn the first card came is king of autumn that's your own energy capricorn that this is your own energy all right either you are feeling very much compassionate all right accomplished charismatic or gifted or somebody sees you maybe this is a person who sees you as a very compassionate accomplished charismatic and gifted person all right you may be dealing with a boss or you both of you may be working together Universe is asking you to be assertive in every moves of yours. Be truthful, be authentic, be righteous, all right? Everything going your way. Even if the situation, the emotions, the triggerings, the 3D existence is adverse to whatever I am saying, all these things are taking place for you in the spirit world. All you need to do in the 3D world is that you need to be very, very assertive, be very truthful to yourself. Be honest. Be loyal. Everything is going your way. It may not look like, but trust me, it is. All right. Because divine has a different way to work altogether. At the end, you'll get what you truly want in your life. All right. But divine has a completely different way to, um, to work with, with us. All right. Before divine gives us something, he wants to teach us something. How to sustain that. All right. That's what I'm feeling. If you have been a person who was uh, doubtful, fearful, always in that uh, coward or fear-based mode all the time, or get agitated, irated, you 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 have the tendency to lie. And then uh, with all this energy, you are praying out to Father. The Father, give me my DM, bring my love back. And God knows that even if God listens to your prayer, with this energies that you are vibrating, uh, you know, you will not be able to sustain this relationship. So God, with all the triggerings, God is cleaning your subconscious mind right now. So that this, what exactly you ask for, bring me this love, bring me this relationship, bring me this commitment. Probably from this person, you have to uh, sacrifice your old self, yeah. You are going through a sacrificial process of who you used to be to who you are turning out to be for probably this man. Or, or this man is now seeing you that, wow, 
through the time apart, you have changed or you are seeing this person that they have changed. However, it resonates for you. All right. Nine of Wands. Yeah, look, I'm telling you, you are praying out to your father for union, union, union them. When I'm going to get union, father? When? When is my time will come? And at the end of the day, with the two of pentacles, you keep juggling. When with the three of winter, you get into that, again, that wounded heart energy, like victim energy. You know, I am so cursed. I am so doomed. And your life goes into upside down. But universe has to say, my dear, all your patience will be paid off. Uh, after you have learned all these lessons, after you have let go of uh, strong commitment, heavy commitment, energy is coming. Something is there beyond your eyes meet is taking place, Capricorn. Something is taking place in your life right now, which is behind the scene. In the 3D, it's all adverse to whatever I'm saying. It may not even resonate with you, but close your eyes, ask yourself. Your subconscious mind will keep revealing things into the surface that and this is going to take place as the moon will start to grow in the sky. You you will be able to see a lot of uh, toxic energy still resides within you in your subconscious mind. All right. Probably you feel that, oh, I am absolutely doing good and out of nowhere you'll feel like, damn, I have this within me that I tend to lose my temper. I get angry or I lack trust, or I, I fear, I have this doubt, I have this insecurities. this will come, all right, this will come so that you see it and consciously say goodbye to this energy so that you are ready for this person, all right, and you can let go of this burden that you are feeling right now with the nine of wands. You are feeling really burdensome, putting in a lot of effort and patience also. You are a person who has a lot of patience or the person that you are dealing with, they have a lot of patience, all right? They are like kind of, you will feel at times like if this person is a stone, if you're feeling like that, trust me, that is also your energy because at times you also tend to be like kind of a stone where you lack all your emotion because you see there is no cup energy, all right? all either pentacle or sword yeah all pentacle or sword energy only one water energy we have that is also like kind of hangman life is upside down all right change the way you are looking at the situation right now or yourself or the other people all right that's the universe nudge for you and that's the reason you are experiencing this nine of wands or uh, three of uh, swords kind of energy all right and that's the reason you are not in, in 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 any kind of union because you are not in union with yourself completely right now all right that's why higher level of commitment is not on your uh, on, in your life right now all right you are still juggling you are still holding on to this three of swords kind of energy juggle and three of swords all right waiting on something you waiting on a sign waiting on a validation waiting on an approval waiting waiting on something that is not the right way for a Capro Capricornian to be vibing, you know. Capricorn, yours is the karma house. It's all about action. That's why Mars get exalted in Capricorn, all right? So with the current planetary transits, Mars is giving you. That's why this nine of wands is Martian energy. This is fire element, right? That's giving you that nudge. Take an action. Make a move, 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 move. Enough of stuck. See things from a different perspective. Keep moving ahead. When you do that, your patience will pay off. With Ace of Pentacles, windfall of money, windfall of name, fame, career, finance, love, relationship, everything will come to you. A happy change is uh, happy changes are coming in your career as well, finances as well, all right? New projects are coming your way. It may be a relationship, it may be money, it may be finances, it may be a new job, new boss, um, new way of earning money. It's just new. All you have to do is stop juggling, say goodbye to this three of swords energy, you know, be a fighter within, then giving up, take action, you have already come a long way, my dear, with the nine of wands. 
so there is no point now giving up one two step and you reach to that ace of pentacle with the union card all right find that union within yourself my dear find that union within yourself know who you you are what is your worth why you are here on this planet earth at the first place why you incarnated as a human being watching this reading hearing these messages what for what exactly you are going to do with this guidance that i'm giving i'm bringing right now or the tarot cards that you watch what exactly is your aim aim uh, the aim end goal that after reading all this after watching all this psychic messages readings this and that i have to doing all this practice i actually want to accomplish this i actually want to get here i actually want to do this set your goal set your intentions positive keep yourself motivated energize all right come out of any victim mentality that you are going through with the three of swords and you know juggling them all the time your life seems to be like a juggle that's how i'm feeling well if you are feeling like this then you are absolutely radiating that energy from you to the universe at the end universe will multiply and give it back to you whether you stand firm keep charging ahead even if the situation is the odd the worst all right keep believing if something is not happening by your will then it is happening by the will of god and then keep going ahead and you will see wow how things change man kudos that i have done this you will be in that energy okay so i hope that this messages uh, uh, has helped you in some way shape or form yeah all right capricorn this new moon you are going to get some kind of psychic downloads to see certain things that will come in the surface meditate and see what exactly this things that is coming as a vision as a random thought and the signs are popping up pay attention to that those are the signs for you that you are looking for and praying to the father in heaven that will help you exactly to be there where you are supposed to be you will be able to make that right choice to get to that union and ace of pentacle in your life because right now you have that feeling of uh, victim mentality like i am lost you know i i'm i'm, I'm kind of i don't have anything you know i have no money no job uh, i have no one to love me no relationship i'm all alone so universe is working in your subconscious mind and as the moon will grow in the sky by full moon you will completely turn out to be a new person altogether when you will be like that and vibrating in that energy this king of pentacle will also see your worth in their life that how much compassion that you have been all through the time how much you are accomplished you know even after they have given you steps after steps you have stood strong for your dignity your pride your existence all right you are really charismatic and you and they will see that you are gifted child all right all you need to say is goodbye to this juggling energy three of uh, swords kind of energies or five of pentacles kind of energies all right your patience will pay off your patience will pay off only just change the way you see at things look at the situations or people around you just change that everything will change I hope this message has helped you in some way, shape or form. Until we meet again, I'm sending across much love and light to you all. Om Namah Shivaya. Stay blessed and in peace. Bye-bye.